In today's Apple Numbers spreadsheet demonstration, I'm going to show you how to use VLOOKUP in Apple Numbers. Now here we have a very basic spreadsheet and we have two tables within the spreadsheet. And on the top table, we have the team members with their salary. And on the second table below, we have their bonus information. And what we want to do is pull in the bonus information from the bottom sheet into the top sheet. This can be done on much more complicated sheets than this, but this is just for demonstration. So let's first start off with Stan's bonus. So on VLOOKUP, what you want to do, so let's go to Stan's bonus cell here, C2, and then you want to press the equals key on your keyboard. This will bring up the function box. And now you want to type VLOOKUP. Now at this stage, you can press open bracket. However, the thing I really like about Apple numbers, you can press enter at this stage. And by pressing enter on your keyboard, this will bring up all the reference points that is needed for VLOOKUP to work. And then you go through each reference point, adding them one at a time. This makes it much easier to work with functions like this. So the first one is search for. So this is what we actually want to search for. So we'll highlight it and then click STAN. As we want to search for STAN. So as you can see, it automatically fills in this part of the spreadsheet for you. Now the second one, column range, you want to click that. So the column range means where you want VLOOKUP to look on the second sheet. So we want to highlight all this bottom table here, as this is where we want VLOOKUP to search. Now the third action is return column. So we want to click that, and this is asking you what column you want to return from, from where they are searching. So as you can see in the bottom data table, A, B, C, and D, but each one starting from A represents one. So one, two, three, four. So as we want to pull the bonus, we want column D. So column D is column four. So one, two, three, four. So now we enter four, as you want the data to be pulled from column four. Now the last data set, you can click the drop down here and you can choose between close match and exact match. So we'll put exact match, as we want the exact bonus to be pulled. So let's quickly break that down before we press the green tick or enter. So the first data set is searching for the piece of information. So in this case, Stan. Now the second data set is where you want the actual VLOOKUP to search for STAN. So you want VLOOKUP to search for STAN within the table below here, all highlighted. Now the third data set, number four, now you want VLOOKUP to search for STAN within this table and bring back column four. And the fourth data point is if you want the information to be returned and it to be exact. So now let's press the green tick or enter. So VLOOKUP can do its work. So as you can see, it's pulled the information for STAN's bonus. 20%, which is correct. Now you don't have to do that for every team member. You can click this little yellow tab below and drag it into the rest of the spreadsheet. And you can see everything's actually right. As I said before, this is a very basic spreadsheet. And if you have a more complicated one, this works perfectly. Let's quickly add everyone's bonus amount. You can press equals in the bonus amount for Stan. Then you can select their salary and then shift an eight for times and then select the bonus amount and then enter. And again, you can drag this down into the rest of the cells and there is everyone's bonus amount for this year. I hope you found that video helpful. If you did, check out this playlist here where we have many other Apple Numbers demonstration videos. And thank you for watching.